I'm Mark Hoffman with STR, School Technology Resources. And in this video, we're going to take a look at the ProScope HR and the Scope on a Rope L2 camera. This is one of our exclusive education kits available from STR. This is an, a ProScope kit with the camera, lenses, accessories, and our curriculum for education that we wrote for the cameras. So I'll put this down, and I will take a look at the ProScope HR. That's this one here. It's the digital version that connects directly to the USB port on a computer. I have it going to my laptop and I have it set up in one of the three modes we're going to look at today. The first is the stand and view mode. So you can put the ProScope on this optional stand and then display any object or point it out across the room for a presentation or use it like a dissecting camera or a document camera. This is has manual focus here so you can zoom in directly on any object you want to view. I'll take the ProScope off the stand now, and I'm going to put the 50x lens on and use the ProScope in handheld mode. So here's the 50x lens. The lenses are easy to change. Now whatever I touch with the tip of the lens is magnified and displayed live on the computer screen. If I like this picture of the inside of the flower, there's a button on the ProScope that I simply touch. And now that image is saved right on the computer as a JPEG file. I'm going to take a picture now of the eye, George Washington's eye on the surface of the dollar bill. And I'm going to change lenses to the 100x lens. And now I'm going to take a picture again of the eye so you can see the difference in the magnifications available. Here's the 100x lens of the eye. And now I'll go to 200x and take a third picture. The highest lens available is 400x for both the ProScope and the Scope on a Rope. So now we can take a look at all those three pictures. There's 50x. 100x and 200x. I'm going to set the ProScope aside now and we're going to look at the Scope on a Rope L2. This is the analog model for a television set. So this plugs directly into the input on a TV set. And I have this set up in the third mode. This is the, the stage and view. So the stage allows you to view prepared slides and water samples. So this is some microorganisms in pond water at the tip of an Elodea leaf. I'm going to take that pond water sample off and put on a regular prepared slide. This is a cross-section of a carrot root at 200x, so we're magnifying 200 times. So prepared slides and water samples are used with the stage. Now I'll go back to the handheld mode with the scope on a rope and show some yak wool at 200x. Again, now with this you just touch and the image is displayed live on the television set instead of on the computer with the scope on a rope L2. Go ahead and take a look at the rest of the site and our other products and give us a call if you have any questions.